Beginning this Friday, Seoul is putting a fresh spotlight on Hanshik or Korean cuisine. So if you're in Korea this weekend, there's a series of gastronomic events hosted by celebrity chefs that will change how you look at Korean cooking. Our Park ji reports. Judy Chu is now a famous Korean-American chef who has her own TV show in the U.S. and her own restaurant in the U.K. She used to work as an investment banker, but says she couldn't resist the charm of cooking, especially Korean cuisine. Growing up Korean, um, I've always grown up with the with the flavors of, of Korea, and so um, you know it was a natural thing for me to gravitate towards Korean food when I chose to, to go into cooking. And also, it's such an undiscovered cuisine still, and I love the flavor. It's very truthful and honest. Um, th th there's no pretension. Ju is an honorary ambassador of Korean cuisine, along with star chef Leo Kang, who hosts a famous cooking show here in Korea. Both celebrity chefs are participating in a series of events as part of the first Hanshik Week, launched to promote Korean cuisine. At an event for a group of ambassadors' wives, Kang demonstrated a simple dish from traditional Korean royal court cuisine using ripe red persimmons and bamboo shoots. Very healthy and good flavors. Ah, it was delicious. Everything here and the organization was very well done. Korean cuisine uses natural organic ingredients and is very close to nature in form and flavor. The Korean food of today is more of salty and spicy, but traditional Korean food is very healthy. The events are hosted by the Korean Food Foundation and aim to give Koreans and foreigners alike a taste of Korean cuisine. A variety of events, including a cooking competition and a cooking demonstration, will continue until this Saturday at the Namsan Hanuk Village in central Seoul. Park Ji-won, Arirang News.